Hey, Murray State, we have made it to week three without switching to online only for the semester. That means it's time for a new season of MSU Tonight. Shoes up, masks up, racers. Welcome to MSU Tonight. I'm Megan Reynolds. Coming up in the show, freshman racer Abby Caps will be here to talk about the freshman experience. We're also going to see if she'll stick around to play a game with us. Right now, it's time for Hot Topics. Fall 2020 intramural sports are coming up soon. This semester's offerings include the two-person golf league, singles and doubles tennis, singles disc and frisbee golf, doubles cornhole, and team kickball. Kickball leagues have been pushed back to September 7th with team registration ending on the 3rd. Better hurry. If you're looking for something to do on the weekends, the Calvert City Drive-In is a great place to go. This weekend, they are showing The Grinch at 7.40 p.m. with Bill and Ted face the music following right after. The Gates and Grill open at 4 p.m. It should be a most triumphant time. If you're looking for something a little closer to home, Murray State's Cinema International will be hosting a viewing of The Return, which is in Spanish with English subtitles. The showings will both be in the theater at 7.30 p.m. on Thursday and Friday. Admission is free. That's going to do it for Hot Topics. Don't go away, though. There's more to come on MSU Tonight. Stay tuned. Welcome back to MSU Tonight. I'm joined in the studio by Abby Caps. Welcome to the show. Hey. Hi. Thanks for being on. You're welcome. All right. So today, of course, we're talking about your freshman experience right. as a racer. But um, first, we're going to focus a little bit on um, your envisionment for what you thought college was going to be pre-COVID era, right. what were you thinking college would have been like? Well, I was thinking there would be no Zoom. Uh, everything would be in person, mm -hmm. obviously. Um, I was also thinking that um, there would be more activities in, through school and I'd be able to get involved more. So, I mean, that's not true. It yeah. didn't happen. <laughs> so that was a lot. Yeah. <laughs> but. All right. Um, so how did, aside from the activities, how did COVID kind of just come in and bolster, especially with these like coming into you know college the move-in experience the, the the first few weeks where you're getting adjusted how has covid kind of impacted and bolstered your previous you know thoughts about it right um i mean i commute so the whole moving in thing doesn't kind of like connect with me um but it was just like the whole you know everything was just not going to be the way i always planned it was going to be especially mm -hmm. the starting out my senior year like it just was all different so yeah so what are some of the oddities, little little quirky COVID things that you've kind of noticed or have like become part of your routine? Um, so the mask, obviously. Yes. Yeah. Uh, well, yours is adorable. So thank you. <laughs> um, I think, I don't know. I just, you know, the mask is the biggest thing. There's nothing really, I mean, obviously keeping distance and stuff like yeah. that. But I mean, I do everything that you're supposed to do and I mean, I don't like I think it's changed a lot of the things I do and like how I do things but mm -hmm. overall I don't really have anything different. E expand on that though like you said that it was changing the way that you're doing things. Right. So like what sort of things have you had to like change? Um, so for example like you know during like before coming to college we were going on vacation can't do that you know mm -hmm. um, or um, for example rush week. Yeah. Um, okay. yeah. So, you know, that changed a lot, you know, it didn't go the way that we had planned and I had to like distance and do everything via Zoom and so just like. So were all like your, that. all your rush events were on Zoom or how did that work? Um, yes, so we had, most of our events were on Zoom, but we had one day, prep day, okay. and that was in person and they only let a couple people into the uh, sorority suites and we all wore masks, we were socially distanced. Um, so that was about the only day that we had in person. And then bid day was also over Zoom. And then, um, yeah, so we, we kept uh, up with like the social distancing and the mm -hmm. healthy aspect of it, but yeah. 
did it feel, ah, oh gosh, how do I word this? Because, you know, in the movies, you see Rush and sororities yeah. as, I don't know, how do, you, how do you beat that idea, especially when you have COVID? So did it still carry that kind of hype and pump, or, you know, um, was it kind of just, you know, huh? I wouldn't say that. I would say I was excited, but um, I feel like making, doing Zoom made me a lot more nervous than I would have been okay. in person, just because I'm an outgoing person. Um, so just being in Zoom and being in one area, like it just didn't live up to expe expectations that movies show and that like my friends would tell me about that are already in college and just so it didn't really live up to what I thought it was going to be. Gotcha, gotcha. So as far as the semester goes, are you dreading it? Has it failed the vibe check? Like, uh, are you doing good? I think I'm doing good. Um, okay. I enjoy a lot of my classes. There's okay. not one class that I'm like, oh, I can't stand it. But I mean... I'm a very big planner and an organization like that's like one of my key things or whatever so I feel like everything's fine the semester's going good but the further I get into college the less interesting it is the to less me. interesting yes hey you know sometimes sometimes it do be like yeah. that oh yeah I it, definitely it really agree. do um so I mean outside of classes are you finding extracurriculars or anything that you're able to really just have a good time in despite that COVID has kind of just right um there is the pre-health club and okay. like the pre-med club on campus so we'll do like zoom meetings and they'll like give us insight and so that's really good to have because I'm going I want to go to med school after college so it's they give good insight and it's very intriguing to talk to other people who have the same um life path after college and all that as me so that's something that I really enjoy that's yeah. that's awesome that's totally great yeah I'm very glad that you have that. Yeah, no. Um, COVID dining has, well, COVID has changed dining on campus. So yeah. are you like like hating college food? Where where do you eat mostly as a um, freshman? I eat at my house because I'm commuting. That's but right. But I've yeah. um, eaten at Winslow's once and it wasn't that bad. I mean. No. Has Winslop improved? Uh, Yeah. Awesome. I'm glad I, to I hear that. I would say so. Yeah, the burger was really good that I had, so it was that is it was good. It good wasn't news. my stepdad good, but it was like good. Gotcha, gotcha. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, thanks for being with us. Um, the show isn't over yet. When we come back, Abby and I are going to go head to head in a game of what's in the box. Who's going to be victorious? I have a spoiler alert. It's, it's going to be me. Definitely me. It's going to be me. I'm sorry to inform you. Yeah. I will win. I'm a good guesser. Good evening. We are back with MSU tonight. Uh, Abby's still here with me, thankfully. We haven't scared her off. We are going to be playing What's in the Box. So we have our uh, Mafia members hidden around the studio to protect us from cheating, because I would never, I'm sure, and I'm sure no, you would never. Oh no. So we're going to, I guess, go ahead and get started. I'm going to have our good team bring us the first item. And I guess we'll just go for it, you know? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. okay. Oh, I just touched your hand. That's an ear. <laughs> it's a like kind of it's like a it's a figure. It's a figure. Yeah. It's a it's got spikes. Uh, it's a very spiky boy. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Is this what? This is uh, This is this is like the outline of hair. There's like Spikies. This is a nose. Is, I literally have He's no a clue. figure. Oh, wait, wait. No, no. it's da is it Darth Maul? Oh what? <laughs> I had the spikies. I was like, Ugh. look at me. One to zero. I'm sorry. I got you. Next it's time. Fine. It's fine. You'll get me next time. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I'm excited. This is good. Wow. Going strong. <laughs> I promise I didn't look at it. No, I you're fine. Okay. Okay. Where is it? Spiders. Oh, yeah. Oh, spiders. Wow. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Fuzzy. Yeah. One to Shall one. We? Okay. One to one. Going strong. Going strong. My feelers are prepared. Why did you make that face? I don't know. It sounds like it doesn't it sound sounds too like good. It's gonna, Ready? Oh God! Okay. Ew! Slime! Oh! Slime! Slime! No. Yes. Is it, slime. Is it slime? Yes, it is. It is slime. 
Oh, oh, oh there's, there's more there's stuff dice. in there. It's but dice. It's I saw slime. it. It's dice. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, I don't, oh. Yeah. And like the thing about slime is that you feel like your fingers should be wet when you yeah. take them away and it's not. I was scared it was going to be something like, I that like stays on my hand. I thought I was going to stick my eggs in, <laughs> my hands in eggs for some reason. I literally was like, this is going to be eggs. Oh. Make sure and feel these well. Feel these well. Okay, ready? Press them and squeeze them. Oh. Whoopee cushion. No, the fart. Yeah. <laughs> is that what it's called? A whoopee cushion? A whoopee, yeah. a whoopee cushion. Oh, How wait. did I know what that was called? Wait, okay. So, one to three? Yeah, I guess. My butt's getting whooped now. <laughs> I got I got the weird one, but it's okay. <laughs> it's fine. Ooh. I don't know how I knew that name. <laughs> like, I really don't. <laughs> Off the top of your head, you said it's, it's a whoopee cushion. Okay, ready? I'm ready. Where is it? Oh. oh. Is there? Is that your hand? Is it just one of oh. them? I guess there is. Oh. Oh, 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 R2-D2. Oh, oh that makes sense. Hey, I pushed the button. He's so cute. <laughs> Look at him. Oh, I pushed his is button. Is he a pencil sharpener? What's There's a that? button on him. There is a button on him. That's so cute. He's so cute. Is it? I don't know what it Can is. Can I have this? <laughs> <laughs> Wow. I think it's funny how, like, you get the, like, action figures. Oh, yeah. 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 That just shows that I, <laughs> you know. Yeah. <laughs> Robots are so cute. My fiance has this little robot goon that he wants to get, and it's like $200. Oh, wow. Okay. okay. Ready? Oh! oh slime again. With what snakes is? in it. Uh. <laughs> I said no! <laughs> I said I didn't want them. You, it's stuck on me. They're kind of cute though, aren't they? They're cute colors. That's about Ooh, it. Ooh, this, this slime smells kind of wonky. <laughs> I'm just going to set like, that right there. <laughs> that's nice. Oh, God. <laughs> Someone hocked a loogie on the table, guys. Yeah. Was, well, that's actually what they did. They just sneezed into the So plate. what is it? 42? Yeah. Okay. This is the last item. This is the last item. Okay. Okay. Ready? Go. I thought that was your hand. It's an animal. Yes? Is it the poop emoji? The no. poop emoji? Is that a fin? Is it a fish of some sort? It's some type of stuffed animal type of thing. Yeah. Yeah. Is it like a heart? No. It has like the feel like you know like the velcro kind of feel on it yeah yeah is it this is Nemo is it a fish no is is it Yoda <laughs> is it some uh, never mind I don't know I don't know why I'm squeezing it like yeah. that's gonna I wanna well it has I thought I felt a zipper on well, it well it's got <laughs> maybe I did it it's got fins <laughs> or are they ears is it a dog a it's not an animal. A piece of pizza. <gasps> no what? way. No. Uh. No. Uh. I don't know how. Okay. So clearly, I lost. It's fine. Congra I'm so proud of you. Thank wow. you. <laughs> truly. I don't know. Truly I thought I was gonna psychic feelers. But there's more on MSU tonight. There's gonna be at least a closer. So we'll get there when we get there. Thanks, guys. <laughs> Hey, so sad, it's time to go, but you can tune into MSU tonight every Tuesday night or at five on MSU TV 11 or visit us on our YouTube channel at the URL below. It's been so exciting to be back. We're so excited to see you guys this semester. And remember, we could not have built the pyramids at Giza without the aliens.